and we are playing Adventure Escape Mysteries, Sweet Dreams Chapter 1 by Haika Games. Let's start. So that's a story about a young boy who's trying to fall asleep and a bit scared about uh, tomorrow. So then we act as a night fairy who is uh, trying to guide him through this, through his dreams and make his day fine. So uh, this Shoko and Ravi are this kind of a night fairies. And first of all, we need to activate this uh, dream center and to uh, run the dream machine. Here we can take a key card and let's right now open this door. And to open this door, we have to light uh, some of these 10 poles. The hint is in this node, we can see that these pink positions are highlighted and we need to highlight the same to open the door. And then before going there, let's look at this screen and display, it should be on, but it is, seems that it is the battery is out. Also, here's a sparkle to take. And then going uh, here, here's a place to charge the battery. Uh, then uh, let's get this part of the tile. Also here it is opened. Uh, one more hex part is here. And then uh, here we have to open this uh, safe, but we have four colors. And the hint can be found uh, also on this uh, display. So if we put battery here, we can see the brain uh, sectors and they have uh, this shape. So yellow has kind of a star with four beams, blue with star with five beams, then green with six beams and pink seven beams. So we have kind of a sequence, yellow, blue, green and pink. Then five, six, now we have five, six on green and the eight on pink. Here's uh, the game has fallen and uh, these hex puzzles are for this place, but we need one more to find. So we have a green key. Let's open that door and go there in. So here we can take instructions and here we can take one more hex part. Nothing to do here for now. So let's go backward and solve this puzzle with hexagons. Uh, we have uh, light beams of three colors and uh, then we need to uh, make them. Uh, uh, we need to connect them. Let's start it like that. So we can see that uh, pink are uh, joined. Let's join this one. So like that. Also we can guide the yellow beam. It is, should be like that. So the blue is joined and now it's on the left to join 
the yellow. So this puzzle is also completed. We can see the power is on to the dream machine. And here it is on now. Now we need to activate it and we have instructions to do it. Let's uh, read it. So we can see here's a hint. So if three uh, bulbs are on, then we need to set this combination of levers. If uh, on not three lights, then this combination. So let's count. We can see that there is not three. So we need to use this combination, this diagonal and down right. Down right, then second hit. If uh, this uh, wires are bubbling or lightning, so we have two different combinations. Here you can see bubbles all around this uh, pole. Uh, that means that we need to use the first line. So it's point to the right and to light green sectors. And the third, we need to set four smiling faces, three set faces and two plain faces. So how can we do it? Like that. And now let's pull the lever. So the first star is on. Here's instruction to set the, the second star. So let's read. If uh, this vehicle is turning uh, counter and uh, clockwise directions, so we need to find it. And it is here, it turns anti counter clockwise direction. So we need to look at this hint, and it's vertical and down left. Then, second, we have boy 7 or boy 5. So the hint is the uh, age, and here you can see that arrow age is 5. So we need to use this hint of 5, and it points down, and 3 lighted. And now for faces, 3 glad, 3 set, and 3 surprised. like that, pulling the lever and the third instruction to solve, but first we need to get this instruction by solving the puzzle and here's the board to solve it. So we need to place all these uh, strips here and then to rotate the board and make this picture completed. So it's a uh, first. And then let's place it this place then house roof and to place others we need to rotate a bit so this for this place this one is here to set then rotate it upside down and the final part here it is like that. And we have the third instruction. Now let's also solve it. So we have date 8 or 9. So to get the date, let's look at the at this door and here you can see it's September 9th. So that means that we need to use this date and it's horizontal and up and right. Then second, we have to count star 7 or not 7. So here we can count them. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 and 8. So this means that we need to use the second row, it's right and one sector highlighted. And the last is three glad, 
to set and for plane. So here's the solution. Pull in the lever, and it seems to be that everything is on, but then something has to go wrong. Okay, so now we need to uh, to fix it somehow, and to we need to open the special door and enter the Elo's dream to hide him from uh, his dream um, else he can't wake up so here's the instruction how to open it but we can see it is misprinted but we can find uh, the hint here's a uh, lever we can find and go into the door so here it is a secret passage let's break the glass and to open this door we need to play the secret tune now if we look at this instruction we can see that the next image is uh, the previous but shifted one line down and uh, so here you can see it's blue uh, teal green so next should be at the yellow line the same thi thing here next should be at the orange and then red and then green so we have a hint like uh, the solution like yellow orange red and green yellow orange red and green so the door is open but there is more puzzles to solve and that's yet not the end of the chapter first here you can take the light stone here you can take key a crank another set of keys sticky note and then let's solve for this puzzle so we need to uh, follow through the different doors and uh, press moon buttons in order that I uh, see in uh, cubes. Let's start from here and we can see it's opened and half on the right. Then let's open this one. So it's here next to put its black hole then this part of the moon and the final is this one so it was not hard to solve it and we've got a light stone uh, nothing to do here in this room so going out for we have a crank and this crank is to rotate this dial and get different objects from different places okay let's check all of them here's slot for something here we can take another set of keys here's sticky note here's a sparkle and here we can take nothing so we can see that one more is unopened and we need to find this token okay going out now we have a ladder so if we lean it here we can break all of these bottles and collect some more notes and keys and the sparkle is here then let's take this cloud this cloud is for this place to open the secret place and get the moon 
and now the moon to open another secret place and get a star gem and then the star gem is to activate uh, here another secret place and here's this uh, celestial gem it's right for this remain place so we have the light stone now we have found all the four light stones we need to place them at this door and then uh, solve the puzzle with the uh, keys so we have all the 15 keys and we have sticky notes so with a hint how to uh, arrange them so we need to combine all of these images at one button and if we look at this row we can see that this row can only be the top row for uh, it can be the bottom for there is star in the bottom and to match this on the top we have it is here or there so let's set a triangle circle rhombus moon and rhombus triangle circle rhombus moon and rhombus then relative to it we have this pink so from moon we have square and triangle under it uh, then oh, for this rhombus we have a diagonal of triangle and star and it can be can start here it can only start here so let's place triangle and star for this place then now we have to set this triangle star circle rhombus and uh, we have only one place to set it so we have triangle star circle and rhombus and now this vertical line so rhombus star and square rhombus star and square and the last remaining key is for the remaining slot so that's done now that's the end of the chapter one and if this video also helped you please leave likes subscribe and fly into chapter two And we are playing Adventure Escape Mysteries with Dreams uh, Chapter 2 by Heike Games. And let's continue the story and adventure of Ravi and Arlot. So first thing, we are to find Arlo and here he is. So let's catch him and introduce. Okay, so who you are? I'm your Dream White. And they decide to travel to this a door and the cloud with this balloon and first of all we need to fix this gingerbread um, gingerbread bridge here we can take a candy cane then nothing to do here for now so going backward what else can we do here we can take a sparkle here we can take candy and with this candy cane we can uh, pull this lever to activate the uh, river uh, windmill and catch this gingerbread heart now let's take it and here's the slot for it now we need to open the door and here's the second lock we can see there are different speeds and for this round candy we need to count all around them so we can see one two three four five and also uh, six seven and eight here let's set eight uh, stars around it then for this uh, kind of muffins you can count one two three four and five one two three four five then cherries 
we have one two three and four one two three four and then this yeah, macarons we can count only seven on the roof so that puzzle is completed and we can go inside the house so here you can see uh, the gingerbread cookies machine and uh, a note with the recipe so we can need four ingredients here to make it and then to start it first of all here we can take this broom in the drawer we can take a brush and here we can take a candy soda now let's wipe these steps climb up and see what's there so here you can see heap of different sweets and all of them have its pairs and we need to find pairs match them and uh, thus uh, take away all, all this heap these ribbons donuts chocolates stars lollipops more lollipops so it is not hard and then finally you can see that there is a key we can get now let's get it and open that drawer get empty bowl and get a cookie mix um, candy eggs and sprinkles okay going out so cookie eggs we can trade with this hen for the sweet get this eggs and then now we have here's kind of a gingerbread llama we can feed it with this soda and then to talk so it full of uh, sprinkles now we can collect them with a the brush so we have all the four ingredients one more thing that we need to collect this icing uh, into the bowl so now let's start the cooking the first ingredient second the fourth or the third and the fourth it is here and uh, also we need to start the oven and to start it we need to set this dials into the proper positions the hint we can find from these steps so first we can see kind of a red uh, fence here it is then yellow with dots and brown chocolate yellow with dots and brown chocolate it's uh, like that so here here it starts and we can see that uh, shapes of this uh, gingerbread cookies uh, are of uh, puzzle pieces and uh, that's why we need to solve this puzzle to fix the bridge so here's the solution maybe there is another solution is possible I don't know but you can try to find it and so now that's done we can travel to the other side of this uh, cookie land so here's the gummy bear whose name is Greta and she advised to uh, use these gumballs as a hot air balloon but to get it we need to find 
requests and uh, help to find her her gummy bear friend okay let's walk around take these items and then with the rope we can pull the first this gummy bear here and get it and also here's the coin in this board and then going backward so here are these gummy bears one two and three also let's take this animal cracker roper and then the remaining gummy bears are here and the last one is here so let's take it and give all of them to Greta uh, then here's the puzzle to solve so uh, to solve this puzzle we need to swap bears to make them bigger and of another color and the green one eliminates and this one grows then let's swap these two merge and these and now it is here little left to do like that so the puzzle is solved and then let's find three coins to put here so we have spoon we can take these ice creams one and two and we have found all the three uh, candies so now we need to give them to this gumber and uh, define which slots are to put on the three of them so we need to look at these clouds we can see it's turtle dolphin and let's wait on the third one oh here's a sparkle to take and the, the third one is a bunny so on this wrapper we can see that turtle bunny and dolphin are the three positions and here we are to set on the three of them now we can get this gumball and then Greta can help us to blow it and then we can here we are to take it and give it to them to Greta to start the travel but something has to go unexpected so that the end of the chapter 2 and if this video helped you leave a like subscribe and go into play next chapter and we're playing adventure escape mysteries sweet dreams chapter 3 by Heike games let's start so we can see that choco came to the room and found something it's a wrong here and here he can see that Arla and Revis are falling down and going to help him we help, help them so they are here on the beach okay let's find a way to how can we get to this door in the cloud and first of all let's uh, make a fire I'll skip all these dialogues so to make a fire we need to collect these branches 
take this fire sign for it is a hint take this stick take this shovel uh, now we can break the castle to get one more stick and then we have four sticks but we need five let's take the kettle take the mitten this door is locked for now we need to find a hint later so where's the last stick and um, okay we have enough of them so we need to place them and at this board we can see uh, the blueprint of a fire so we need to look at the shapes of these branches and build them the same way for example this one match for this branch and we need to set it here to make this shape then central one is for the red then this this one this part is a part of the yellow uh, branch and then something uh, is wrong here we have misplaced uh, this one we need to place here and for this slot here's a short uh, short branch like that now for this so in short we need to make them like purple blue and light blue so that's uh, the correct uh, pile of wood and then we need to uh, fire it so let's fire it with the stars first we need to dig out two of them and then with the help of mittens we can collect them here's particle to take and now let's use the stars to start a fire now we have a fire then we can collect water uh, at the kettle and boil it to unfreeze this ice so what can we see here here is it's kind of a beaver or someone like that who is uh, the lighthouse keeper and he yeah he said that here's another way to open the lighthouse but we need to find the hint and the hint for this back door we have a square and circle on the other side and different animals and also here we can see circle and square and different symbols so let's look at them so for this it's kind of a bicycle so we can see that uh, there is a tiger on the bicycle and uh, he goes uh, close to the circle so we need to move it uh, at the at the circle position then second is uh, the whale so let's look who is on the whale the penguin is sky skis and we can see that elephant is on the whale so elephant goes for this second position then these are kind of ski and ski is for for this penguin we can see ski is in the center penguin is here then next four wheels and it's a car and the last goes uh, the fox oh, here it is and the last uh, is for two heels and these two heels are for this uh, to show the camel and the frog goes close to the square so we have it is opened and here's the set of flags now we can see the same silhouettes of flags here and the same colors 
let's solve it so for this shape of round flag we have blue color and let's look at this so this is a flag and blue is a circle so we need to select a circle shape here then red and triangle shaped flag here it is and also red is also a triangle then white and this sharp flag here it is and uh, white are two triangles looking at each other then yellow and this spikes flag so we can see yellow is part of a triangle and, and the last is uh, rectangle black uh, here it is and uh, for the rectangle black we have black rhombus so that puzzle is complete and we can go into the lighthouse so it's kind of an underwater level in the lighthouse and we need to climb up through the stairs to uh, to solve different puzzles and find items so here's a spiky man uh, spiky hedgehog who, uh, urchin who gave us its spine and also in this crack of the wall we can find the uh, starry, starry and it goes uh, to his octopus friend and the result we've got a barrel then nothing to do here for now let's go upstairs here we can see that this turtle is sleeping on the barrel here we can take it this crab wants to go inside this castle and to open it we need to find three flags and set them on these uh, towers next here's the false uh, tile but here's the button we, that we can't use for now now we can open the window so here we can see different kinds of different shapes and this hint that we will use later then balloons let's pop all of them and we've got one more flag and in the red one we have a it's a, a party cracker so this party cracker is to wake up this turtle ask you to move a bit and get this uh, barrel okay let's go higher so here's a pirate parrot who wants something to eat let's take sparkle let's take this gemstone and this gemstone we can trade with this cat for this um, candy cotton and this candy cotton is right for this parrot so in result we can see that uh, these buttons are on let's pu push them and three more to light on to open the chest going up there the chest is opened and we've got a coin and then let's look at this cannon mighty mouse is guarding this cannon so one more time and let's do the same thing third time for it is a pearl inside it And next here's a barrel to take and we can see the fish it's a clue and five flowers so running down 
and we can see this fish is here it swims from this purple to blue and then pink uh, yellow and oh, it's a start position so let's look once again the sequence pink purple blue pink and uh, yellow let's set it here pink purple blue pink and yellow so inside here's one more barrel so we have found all the four barrels we can go down and set all of the four of them here to get one more uh, coin going up we have found two flags but one more to find uh, now let's play this game so we need to hit uh, this uh, barrels according to the rules and uh, these guides are the hints of so first rope is tied we need to follow this rope and we can see that it is tied to a jellyfish so we need to hit the first as a jellyfish then for the second column let's follow the second rope and it is a bed then third column and the third rope it is for the lightning four Four is a uh, butterfly. Five. One, two, three, four, five. Five is dragonfly. Then six. Six is heart, and let's also check the seventh. And seventh is a dragon, so he will have heart and dragon. <laughs> that is completed, and we want one more, uh, one more coin. Okay, so we need to find a flag. So where is it? And going down for this flag is attached at the tail of this fish. So now we have all the three flags. We need to install them here and then solve the puzzle to guide this rabbi through the castle. So we need to follow through all of these shells. They work as a uh, portal. So for example, if you walk in here, we have walk out of the same sh shell and finally we need to get to the grabs uh, mummy okay let's walk it like that red and then green and yellow this one and out here Then let's follow through the bloom into another bloom. Pink, green, 
uh, yellow and purple then pink again and then white so there is there are possibly other solutions for this maze but that's my solution and that's done so we have got one more coin now we have found all the four coins we can set them here and open the door to the lighthouse one more room to solve puzzles so here's sleeping seal here let's wake him up so he can help us but first of all he's stuck in this chair we need to help him out first uh, let's take this item take the parcel take the corkscrew and this corkscrew is to open one of these bottles we can see that there is a key inside one of them now we can take this key and use it to open the mirror for it is a sculptor and a soap so with the soap we can release the seal and then let's give him a parcel for inside here's one more sculptor another one is here and the fourth is on this place now we need to place them to the places but they are misplaced and to find the correct uh, sequence let's turn on the lights and in the lanterns we can see square triangle rhombus and uh, tilted lines square triangle rhombus and tilted lines and then to solve one more puzzle to select the correct symbols but to solve this puzzle we need to find one more thing so he gave us a telescope and with this telescope we can look at the star at the uh, skies and stars and different objects are there and let's check once again so here you can see this kind of a uh, planet and according to the shape around it we have a place marked with a star relative to this planet so here's this spiky planet and according to the square we have just a round planet at the place of the uh, of the star here it is then the Saturn and it makes a triangle and below the Saturn here it is this is a triangle and below here's a satellite then rocket and rhombus for the place of the star we have these four objects and on the place of the star we have three small planets and uh, now this is another small planet and a rectangle and on the opposite side oh here's this planet here is this rectangle and on the opposite side we can see it's a galaxy there so okay we've got stars more stars we can get with this net and then here's a hint on the floor and in the globe also a hint that we need to solve so we can see this red sails so we can see red sails are for letter a this means that the first letter to be placed here is letter a so it consists of two parts then for the second place we have this anchor and the anchor is is here on the ship with letter eight let's make make letter eight okay then something else should be placed here oops eight next skull with the crossbones here it is and letter o it consists of two half circles 
and the last letter is for this uh, blue and white sails here it is and letter Y let's make it so that's also completed and we have got more stars now with the stars we have to solve the puzzle in the lighthouse lantern so we need to place all the stars to the proper position for note two stars of the same color will meet uh, there and we have a limited amount of stars so for example we have that this area touches one two and three so these three are of colors blue white uh, red and yellow this can't be blue so let's assume that this one is blue uh, then this can't be blue neither so we can think that this one and this are of the same colors and let's mark them as red and that way this should be yellow then we can say this can be yellow and this can be yellow so these both are of remaining colors so red and purple let's set red for this one and purple for this place uh, then for this cell we have only uh, the remaining color is blue here we have blue and red so it's either yellow or either purple let's set it purple for we have many of purple stars then the last yellow is to be placed here and let's solve the puzzle with remaining amount amount of colors and we can sell solve it like that so the puzzle is solved and we can now direct the lantern to the door in the cloud and finally travel to this cloud door and that's the end of the chapter 3 so if this video will through helped you don't forget to leave likes subscribe and step by step we're going to play the uh, fourth chapter and we are playing adventure escape mysteries with dreams chapter 4 by hiker games and let's continue the story of on this airlo so here's a sleep mom tries to wake him out but he's still asleep so finally they came to the door and the cloud and you can see four portals that can bring them back to wake up but he and doesn't want to wake up and this uh, power of mind made uh, these portals turn off now we need to find a way to turn them on again let's collect these pieces of portals here's a sparkle to take uh, let's look around near them so one more part is here next portal here's a crystal fragment to take nothing else and this portal one more fragment and uh, here we can take this uh, part of the ring so we have four parts and we can place them here on this placement and we can see that there are uh, leaves activated and also starts as a clue so let's look at these carvings on the wood and relative to the star we have two different leaves on the opposite sides so we need to remember them and set the same leaves here like that so relative to stars then second carving it is on the top and on the opposite side this one is already here that we said and then these two sides so let's select 
it's like that and this one leaf is this so we can see that something has happened the uh, tree lowered here we can take a branch in this water lily we can find one more fragment also in this portal we can take one more part and another water lily with an orb so let's take this sparkle going backward and now let's make two halves and we can see that symbol of kind of an air so relative to the stars we also need to set this it's kind of a seashell and it's a water drop like that and this let's check it so okay it's much and then it's kind of hydra and this is a drop like that and for these two okay we have seen this already now let's match this to this splash and this is a whirlpool this whirlpool is already there so we need to activate the splash and then that's done so one more uh, ring, uh, one more part of the ring and let's place both here to activate the third gem and it's fire symbols let's start from the top so it's normal fire and this the flames looks like looks like that then here on the opposite sides with two small flames and burning with an arrow and the last two so dancing and very dancing dancing and very dancing So that's done, all the three rings are activated and we can see the fire is on. Okay, now let's light this branch. Uh, first we need to use this branch to get these lanterns from the tree before we light the branch. And now we can light it and go through the uh, three portals hang the lanterns here open it and light these crystals to get to get more orbs one then here is second to light to get the blue orb And here's the red orb to get. So now all these four orbs goes go to that place. And uh, we need to place them on the right positions. So these positions are marked with these carvings. And we need to look at this northern light so it's kind of a shape of letter Z and color of these crystals is uh, teal so teal goes to this position then here we can see three lines for the green crystals green is for three lights then here we can see two lights for the for the purple and so remaining is for the red let's check it so here we can see the same northern lights so we can place it here so that puzzle is also solved and what have we got 
we can see that something has happened to that portal and we can place the uh, first uh, crystal of four fragments and it is activated the first portal so we can uh, jump through it okay let's jump and continue the story So they are falling down to somewhere and the somewhere is a uh, bunny's dream. So we can see that there is a lot of bunnies and he seems to be lost but his friends are behind these bunnies. So we need to find a way through them and the hint are their ears so th we can see that some of the their ears are point to each other so starting from this one his ear is pointing to this one going there by these paths and this is the final this is the final point for he is showing at himself and we have came to, uh, to the playground and then to get the river from where she is we need to make a rainbow okay let's begin and look around nothing we can do here for now let's climb up and here we can find a cup that we can fill with the rainbow liquid then this rainbow liquid is to uh, to oil and different attractions and collect the various things from there so here's the keychain then let's oil the CSO to make this bunny jump and get an hour clock then this one to slide down and get the coin and so with the coin we can pop this balloon with one more hourglass and let's get it and then uh, here we have a backpack and to open it we need to set one of these symbols so the hint we can get from this uh, so bubbles we can see that hearts we have three bubbles of heart shapes then stars two and this uh, spiral one and moons are uh, four bubbles so that means that we need to set moons for the fourth position first is for the spiral two stars and three hearts so inside we have a jump rope that can be used to fix this swing now they can swing and turn this cloud upside down to get one more hourglass and then this hourglass with colored sands we can place here and sort the colors okay let's begin let's start with white oops we no don't need to start with white we'd better start with red so one more red goes there so you can see each time we uh, pour the sand it uh, changes its uh, direction so if we pour the yellow here we can get the green on the top Uh, red and then we can pour pink and completely uh, fill the red and then let's make pink 
add a yellow, add white, light blue, then blue, and also the white center is uh, finished. Then green, pink, yellow, green, and yellow back again. Now it's only a little left to do. So blue goes to that place, light blue, and finally blue. So all the colors are sorted out and the puzzle is solved. So we can see that there is a rainbow bridge is made. So now we can just jump and slide on the rainbow. Uh, next, what do we need to do? We need to find a crystal. So here's the set bunny who wants his uh, chocks to play this hopping game. And we can see that these chocks are here near the sand. We can give it to him for he has drawn the pattern here. And this pattern and a sun relative to to relative to the sun we need to remember this pattern and repeat it here so uh, the sun and relative to it we need to make it's like that so here's the box that we can open with this keychain and inside here's a uh, food sandwich and apple. Let's try to feed one of these bunnies. And here's the set bunny. Here's in the lunch room. He wants something sweet. And uh, we can try to trade this uh, sweet with another bunnies. So we have apple and sandwich and we can trade it for different ingredients to finally get this cupcake. So we have to trade it for chips. Then on the second screen chips we can trade for carrot and sandwich. Then let's trade two carrots for three sandwiches. Then six sandwiches to trade for two milks. Oops, something went wrong, so let's try once again. Uh, chips. Chips for carrot and sandwich. Then three sandwiches for milk. Two carrots for one more chips. Then again chips for carrot and sandwich. three sandwich for milk and two milks for four carrots to get two chips okay then two tips we can exchange for milk and five cookies so in result we need to find six uh, twelve cookies then let's try it once again and repeat this trick So we have 10 cookies and finally we can get only chips, chips once again here, then cookie, carrots 
again carrots and five carrots for five cookies so that's enough cookies to trade and we've got the cupcake so now the puzzle is completed now we can trade this cupcake for the crystal and to end this uh, chapter let's touch this crystal and return back to the cloud so if this video walkthrough helped you please leave likes subscribe and go into play the next chapter so let's jump there And we are playing Adventure Escape Mysteries with Dreams Chapter 5 by Haika Games. Let's continue the story. So now they came to the next portal and we can see that Erlo wakes up but somehow it's not his bed but it's a sock drawer in his room. So he's shrinked in his own room and now let's find items solutions and solve puzzles okay so we need to go to the living room uh, where uh, the crystal is and to get it so we need to travel there with this plane by the wind channel okay let's collect items game disk blocks we have nothing let's look at this cat in the box oh there are other blocks there and then let's look under the bed we need more light to get the hint from there we can see that there is something is hidden there and blocks and in this dinosaur we can take the battery and then this battery goes to that remote control and to activate it we need to uh, I guess what cells to activate with the stars the hint is shown on the ceiling and let's activate the same stars here like that so what have we done uh, we have moved the track uh, under the bed and then if we look there we can see that there are four of tracks and each one has a block in shape of uh, digits so five seven four two five seven four two is uh, the hint to enter the same levels here five seven four and two and then let's activate the ladder so with this ladder we can climb up uh, to reach the plane and then here's a disc to take let's take it and going up for there is more uh, items to collect discs laser pen colored pencils oh, we need not colored pencils we need a rubber calendar it's a hint and here's a sparkle then we can see that plane is missing its tire and the tire we can get from make from this button let's attach it there and then we need to uh, find the winding key to start the plane then here's the cat and we can play with the cat with this laser pointer okay so inside the box there are missing parts and missing blueprints how to make the mechanism to use it here so here's this blueprint 
green basement, then red layer, green, yellow, and so on. If you place all of these tools here, we can build it. So first of all, red, and then two green and one yellow. And then goes blue, then red, All right, and the last is this long part. Uh, next, we need to throw these dice at uh, the uh, at the certain cells. The hint we can find uh, con consists of two parts. First, uh, these growth marks. And we can see that they are of different colors and different dates. So let's look at this one from bottom to top. We have June 24th. And uh, June 24th is uh, this cell. So this board is the same as for, and it is yellow, we need to remember. So this pattern is uh, the same as this calendar and cell for June 24 match with this one and it is yellow all six discs or oh, one more disc is missing let's find it here it is okay so we can place it here and then June 24 to uh, place for this cell with this catapult. And then second mark is Ju July 21 and we have July 21 is this place so third from the bottom. Here it is and it is red. And then let's July 31 red and July 31 is this place so it match for this cell and next mark is August 30 red August 30 here it is one two three four five it's in the center And then to yellow are remaining September 16 and September 25. So September 16 is here. And September 25 is uh, the second line. So here we should place it. Okay, now the puzzle is complete. And we want the winding kit to start the plane and fly through the wind channel. So okay, let's fly and there there is a terrible uh, puzzle. So we can see that one part of this web is missing and uh, all of them are the same but mirrored. So we need to select the correct one of you know, four choices. So let's start and we can see it is here. So this one is correct. Then to match this one is seems to be not this one, but okay. This one next. We have guessed it correctly. Not this one. Then this, so we need to look at the same things and so it's some way always uh, the second is correct. 
I don't know, maybe it is the correct solution always to tap second. Let's try. So I have tested all the time the second web and it worked for me. Now we arrived at the living room and there is more puzzles to solve to get this crystal that is there. Okay, let's collect puzzle pieces. Take this uh, colored pins, but first we need to find a hint. Then here we can take a uh, gum. Here's the sparkle is hiding. And uh, with these steps we can climb up the table. Let's take the yarn. Here we can take a tape, a wire to take that we can use to reach the key. Then with the keys to open the drawer. And with this tape we can climb down. Also let's take this pin. So there are different items to take, pencil, pin, break the glass to cut this tape and get these colored pins. So it seems nothing to do here, going out, one more pin here to take and we need several hints to climb up and reach this uh, gem, so going down. Let's disattract the cat with the yarn. So now we can take the missing pieces of the puzzle and assemble it. So we need four pieces, but we have only three. Then one more piece is hiding here. And we can reach it if we use pencil and something sticky on the end. So we've got it and let's uh, complete the, the puzzle. The puzzle itself is a hint and uh, then first let's solve uh, this puzzle. So here we have numbers and this number shows how many cells are activated around it including the, self, uh, the cell itself. So for example this 4 means that we have all the 4 around it activated. Uh, then here we have 5 and it also 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5 activated. And then uh, this cell can be activated so we can uh, mark it with the cross, red cross. For if the cell is here and then uh, for this two uh, we can place only uh, there but uh, there is only one so it can be here. Then for this five we have 1, 2, 3, four and five so now it is filled and here we don't have uh, a thing. Uh, next the three also has all the three filled and then the six one two three four five and six so all the six are around and then for this uh, digit three we have one two and one is here so for this one uh, they also match so we don't have here and we don't have it there. Uh, then uh, what does it mean? For this 5 we have 1, 2, 3, 4 and someone is uh, near there. Then we have to set uh, the second cell for this 2 so it also match for 1 then we don't have cells here and there. For this two, 4 we have 1, 2, 3 and 4, then it is also for the 3, so we don't have cells here and there. For this 5 we have 1, 2, 3, 4, so only one place is to set here, then we don't have it here and we don't have place uh, there. Uh, next let's 
let's look at this five this five also has five around it then this four has one two three and four then this one already has so we don't have it here and there one two three and the three also has all of them so only one remaining it can be it can be here for this four we have one two three so it only for this place and then uh, this picture can uh, give us a hint that there is an image of uh, turtle and dolphin and also uh, here we can see a pattern and the same pattern is on this puzzle and we only need to remember the patterns with turtles and dolphins we can see that they are here and uh, we need to mark the same patterns here one two three turtle dolphin turtle then turtle a dolphin turtle dolphin and a dolphin like that so that puzzle is completed we can get the pin this final pin to reach this crystal get it and go travel back to the portals to the island and the clouds so okay it is activated the last portal now let's jump there and go to the next chapter so if this video will throw helped you please don't forget to leave a like subscribe and play in further and we are playing adventure escape mysteries sweet dreams by hike games chapter 6 so let's start and continue the story so finally they came into the third portal and it's kind of a plain room with the different items all around here now let's check different places so here we can see a maze and this maze uh, of different colored pipes is the hint the hint for this puzzle so we have starting color is green and then one two three four and five colors between uh, big pink dot so here it is and we need to it's a starting point point so we need to find the next uh, way consisting of uh, five pipes of another colors so the solution is first green then yellow then blue then this uh, crimson then this turquoise or uh, teal color and then green again so we came to this uh, pink ball and let's select the same colors yellow and blue and then crimson or like that teal and green now it is completed so we can see that the star picture is printed and here's the magical frame that if we put the picture here it transforms into the object and then the star is a key to open the door and go to the room uh, let's go there here's uh, a hint that we need to follow through all of this maze but we can see that the arrows are mirrored so arrow up means down left means right and so on so we need to move by these arrows this point there but we need to move to the right then to the right to the right down right up right 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 down down so that way we need just to follow in the backward direction and there is nothing 
nothing difficult in this puzzle just to keep in mind that the arrows are pointing the wrong direction and then here's next puzzle to solve and uh, we have a star on the top as a clue and relative to the star we need to paint this uh, middle image according to this colors for this one we have black white black white black and white now let's look at this a star and relative to it we need to set um, black white white black and then opposite sides white and black like that then this one is just upside down rotate it white and black black and black and then white and that seems to be done and now the remaining colors are black white white is already here I have painted somehow then this one is black white black and white oh and this also white so somehow this one should be black so now the picture is done and one more puzzle to solve so we can see sequence of three patterns and we need just to move through all of these three patterns step by step one two three four then one two three four one two three four one two three four one two three four and the same is here just to keep going through all of these patterns till the end now that's also done and uh, we have uh, cubes with uh, cube buttons with different symbols and also part of the hint the first uh, hint for these cubes is shown here so we have a triangle pointing down and we have uh, to use it so we have only we have let's move from left to right so star minus circle and triangle pointing down star minus circle and triangle pointing down nothing happens so let's use the same sequence but from right to left triangle down circle minus star triangle down circle minus and star also nothing then let's turn then upside down and use triangle up circle star circle minus and star triangle up circle minus and star triangle circle minus star not that triangle circle minus and star triangle circle minus star okay now we have guessed it correctly so we've got a second part of the picture and these two pictures we can transform into the real game board with this magical frame then go uh, here sparkle we have to take then go there and solve a puzzle so we have a board and we have transparent films to match uh, the same pattern and uh, build the complete square so let's uh, begin and first of all for this section we had to place it like here so i show you only the solution
and now it is not hot to place all the other items one two three and the last remaining is like that so the puzzle is also solved so what has happened something has happened outside so here's a button for change the gravity uh, has appeared so with this button we can change the gravity now we can reach another uh, another cells and let's try to open this but we can't read it so we need to rotate once again so the head goes dizzy from this turns up and downs but that's the game so once again we have folded unfolded hint here it's moon minus star and circle star up uh, moon minus star and circle so here's uh, another hidden room has opened where we have got the key in the glass and then here's the place for this glass ball and let's break it to get the key okay when then with this key we need to open that lock and here's a puzzle to solve but first we need to find uh, two more pegs and a hint how to solve it uh, so we have four different uh, transports and we need to cover them uh, different icons let's look at this hint one frame for the ring two frames for the star up three for the star down and four for the uh, for the moon let's uh, go and use it there ring star up star down and moon so we have got a hint that and uh, two remaining packs and then we can see that this truck uh, must cover rabbit plane must cover crab when cover lollilop and both to cover uh, lighthouse so we need to solve this puzzle like that and these packs we had to use here so both to cover the lighthouse if we uh, turn it upside down they will fall then uh, this when to uh, cover the rabbit so we need to stop it here track to cover uh, this track to cover the rabbit and this to cover the lollilop and plane to cover uh, crab uh, let's also let's leave it here for a while then if we turn it upside down and remove this plank for example here or here we can see it is on its position and then we need to fix them there uh, for they are to be on their positions if we turn them upside down now turning them once again and all of them are on their positions covered so we can see the small ball rolled out let's take it and play this small game so here we can place it and uh, then we need to uh, use the switches to transform uh, these lines to roll this ball into the uh, proper hole Uh, 
okay the first is opened then where can we guide it so then let's start it once again from the top and guide it to this white hole then we can take it switch at this and run it to this hole and the one hole remained is uh, this one don't need this ball anymore but we can see that there are four samples has appeared and on the ceiling we can see a sparkle and also a hint from darkest to lightest and uh, these are uh, first cross uh, the cross then circle then rectangle and then ring cross circle rectangle and the ring so we've got a confetti ball. Now we can take it and put it into the confetti machine to throw a hint. And this hint is a picture, torn picture of the door. Then if we assemble it, let's assemble it. So we can see a door and using the magic frame we can transform it into the real door. And also here's a place where we are to use it. So we have placed it here and activated. So let's go through this door to another room where the crystal is. So there is uh, more puzzles to solve. A uh, diamond guy who will help us. But first we need to help him and we need to fix his uh, shrinking machine. To shrink it, uh, uh, to fix it we need to find gold, uh, gear and lever. So gold is here. Then lever is in this place and here's the winding key so here we can see a gear let's take this sparkle take the ball and uh, these portals uh, can um, uh, guide this ball through the hole so white pink and we have got the gear and then let's fix this machine lever gear and gorge so we can shrink this diamond high back to a small size 
and now in result we need to ask him for help to reach uh, this crystal ball so but uh, he can't get through the steps for he is too small but we can but we can help him with this painting so let's use it as a ladder he goes there to push the button and open this uh, cage oh we've got one more ball and finally to open this gem we need to place uh, three balls on the three stands uh, next what can we do let's solve another puzzle we can see these different faces and four cells to place them so for this symbol we can treat is this one as a combination of okay it is uh, a bit early enough first let's open this jumping jumping spring to get another key and this key is to open uh, drawer where we can get the hint so now this symbol we can imagine like this oval uh, and a cross on the on the intersection we can see that sl sleeping face is here and here it is let's place it here then this one can be made of heart and pants so here's heart and here's pants so this angry face here it is it goes there then star and minus looks like that so rectangle and star on the bottom so this face with one eye closed and then moon and triangle so you can see triangle and moon and this just a plain glad face like that the puzzle uh, first puzzle is solved and another puzzle to solve is to arrange these different uh, shapes and we have a hint what positions should equal and what uh, should not so for this row we have a hint that one of each type should be present here and here's a direct hint that we need to place here a blue oval and also this one should equal so we can place it here then we don't, can't place square for this position but we can place square for this position okay let's place this one here so this place is is best for star and then let's try the rectangle for this position so everything is much uh, here we can see for this it's not hexagon and not square and these both are not equal so not hexagon not square and not these two so we can only place a star for this place and the remaining one of these two then we have this one equals to the top so let's place hexagon on the top then this one doesn't equal to star so you can place a, a hexagon here but we can't place hexagon here for it is equal to this position and there is no hexagon so both places are for squares these two should equal and there's only one star so we can't place both stars here let's place one star here and two hexagons then we can see that these two are also equal and we can place only stars here and the remaining position is for the uh, square so we have settled all of them and now we've got a large crystal 
so large crystal we can put on this place if you throw through the white portal and then here's a medium portal a medium stand for the uh, this one now let's turn the light of this one and this one so if we th throw it through the green green to red red to blue and then it is here and the small one we can place on the remaining stand so that's almost the end of the chapter the end of the puzzles here they have got the crystal now trying to activate uh, the final portal let's place it here and then jump through there So then we can see the bunny uh, was caught into the portal, then arrow jumps there and Ravi and Shudzo also jump there, Shoku. And at the end of the chapter, so the final one is left. Don't forget to leave likes, subscribe and go into finish uh, this game finally. And we are playing Adventure Escape Mysteries with Dreams Chapter 7 by Haika Games. And that's the last chapter in that game where uh, Erla is to finish uh, the, his adventure through the nightmare part and defeat all of uh, his fears. So here he is in the world of his nightmares. He has lost his bunny and we need to take it. First of all, we can uh, crack this twig to get rid of this web and get the key. And then here's a sparkle we can take. And then key is to open that box. And inside here's screwdriver and also here's uh, garden clippers to finally release the bunny and bring more hope to to Erla. Okay then let's meet his nightmares and defeat them. So he has a lot of fears. We can see that tickets flying and two of uh, animals who are also going to visit school uh, he here and they also have many a lot of fears uh, we have this moon as a boat umbrella as a sail and to trade this umbrella we need to trade it for the scarf okay let's give scarf and now we have an umbrella and so with this umbrella let's sail through the uh, through the trees and collect uh, tickets okay let's collect them one two we can enlarge speed three four five six seven eight nine and ten and also here you can take this seeds mm -hmm. I uh, haven't been in time to take them but okay so here's the crow and we have this wire but he wants his bird's seeds uh, but okay let's get the bell then open this machine and right to fix it we need to find the wire okay so let's sail once again and finally 
get this seeds at the end here uh, was a sparkle and also look at these scrolls and the letters that this would make so it's like letter E and four crows so here are some flower seeds now we can exchange these seeds for this wire and then to fix uh, this machine okay so loading now here now how to fix it with the common way and then let's insert tickets so we have found all the 10 tickets let's insert them and the password now we need to find the password is hidden with this uh, crow so the crow is like a clue here let's write once again and count uh, crows and the trees and look at the shape of these uh, trees so we can see two crows of on the letter I then we can see that one crow on letter T three crows on letter M and four crows four crows on letter E so in result we have the word time as a password and let's enter it here T I M E so already all we need to add the bell to ring it and call for the school bus here it comes now let's take the seeds and uh, we can see that uh, this Aussie from the previous chapters is a driver so now he wants Erlos to uh, match all the pairs in the bus and to do it we have a plan so we can see that there is no uh, two pa pairs alike and every pair is unique for example we don't have two giraffes we don't have two hippies and uh, so on so let's mark them here so two giraffes are here or there but okay let's start uh, let's start from this pair crocodile and hypo or okay let's try to select this pair then we can select this pair these two we can't select for we already have them now let's select pairs like that then let's select these two giraffes here this one this one let's match with this and these two pairs are split so we can easily mark these two okay so in short we can make all the pairs like that we can use this plan to match but uh, in short here we had to set pairs of uh, to f to find all the pairs that should be different and that looks like that maybe there is another solution is possible but that's mine and let's travel further to school so here's one more uh, pupil he's running and taking a, his seat near near Erlo so now we came to a school and here's a serious Mr. Red Pen so to pass to the class he wants me he wants Erlo to fill uh, the uh, blank here 
to fill the map map is on the table here it is and to fill it uh, we need to find stamps grains and stickers we don't have any of it so we need to find it. and let's look around uh, in the school and find it so going to the right this box is closed so there we go here's a ruler but we can't read it yet going further let's open this so we have a set of stickers and here we can get a book from this magic picture then going further here's a li librarian man mr good book and he wants uh, a book from me let's try to give it but he only accepted through this drawer so we need to open it somehow it is jammed I'm going through them here's a stool to take and then with this tool we can read this place and get the ruler and then ruler is to unjam this drawer so grains are here and then let's return the book and we get ID card so we have crayons we have stamps what else uh, can we do his job not to talk to anyone stamps crayons and also we need to find uh, stamps so stamps are here behind the glass and to open it we need to use this identity card okay let's do this task and we can see this map is a map of a school office is the center point and we can see doors uh, and center places so we need to mark doors enumerate them with these numbers from 0 to 9 paint them with the correct colors and set the correct stamps in the center so let's begin uh, here's an office and on the left side we can see there is a digit 2 and so let's make a stamp of digit 2 for this place and then its color is orange and uh, now we need to define the stamp and uh, the adjacent door and here we can look so here's a yellow door and it shows two orange doors so one orange door is two and two orange doors is two plus two means four so yellow and four let's make a stamp four here and paint it with oops paint it with the yellow and the sticker let's look we can see that there are orange squares on the background so let's stick this one then go in uh, further the clockwise direction we can see a blue uh, door and these butterflies are of digits 3 so we have 3 and blue door then next to it we can see that white and one and also a yellow rectangle one white and yellow rectangle then let's look at others doors uh, as parts so yellow and zero and orange and six dots we can see and here we can see it is blue rhombus uh, first we have zero and it is yellow and then we have six dots uh, on the orange door 
and it is all marked with this blue rhombus okay going further then eight green and uh, yellow we can see there one two three four five six eight and nine are stopped out and seven is missing so this should be number seven yellow seven and triangle for this place uh, so eight green seven yellow and white triangle and the remaining stamp we can go this direction and look for the green one two three four five six seven eight and nine nine green and five white and green circles uh, so we have uh, since we went through this direction so uh, here we have nine green then we have five of white color and sticker of the green rings now the puzzle is completed and we are about mm. to go into the class but first we need to uh, you're in the room 9 and tabby, uh, copy number is 308 so we need to leave the backpack there and also we need to solve the puzzle to open it so here's the hint Erlos Kabi the library is closed and we can see that there is a muddy window but uh, okay what else do we see here we can see this uh, Kabi but we need one more thing So now we need to open uh, the box and here's the felt style on the floor so it hides a key that is to open this lost and found box inside here's the uh, Mr. Junk Scarecrow junk in the box but here's much friendly and then insist to for Erlo to take the scarf now we need to wet the scarf and use it to uh, clear this window so now we have a plan that consists of uh, colored corners so for example top left corner uh, are two red lines and if you look at this plane we can see that two red corners on the top left are for the B symbol and going to this copies we have this uh, reduced corner as a mark and we need to set the B for this place then second is for the bottom right corner and here you can see colors of yellow and red yellow and red uh, on not this one but yellow on the bottom and red on the right so it is for the rainbow symbol let's select rainbow then uh, up and right corner is green and blue green and blue for this ladybug and bottom and left we can see that bottom is left is blue and black blue and black is for the bird let's select bird for this 
less symbol and the puzzle is solved so we can place the backpack there and go into the classroom so go in there to meet the teacher and solve other hard puzzles okay here is the classroom teacher and classmates let's talk to them and help them so this giraffe uh, wants something to use scissors here's a cube block to take one more and the third one then this frog has a, a plank with the July symbol he wants his favorite ball to play then his Kelly wants his glasses for he doesn't see well here we can turn on these pages and get the number three let's talk to this hamster for here it is cold enough there but here we can take the paper and here we can take another block and hippo he wants but she wants she wants something to play her dolls okay so we have paper and let's place it here and now we need to trade scissors let's trade them for the cubes okay then with scissors we can solve for this puzzle so here we have to cut this paper into pieces like that and let's do it so first cut then a first cut to do a second cut to do oops I was a bit too fast let's start once again here we are to cut then this part we can split for two triangles smaller this one and this one then let's cut this corner for we have now this triangle and then this one to split for small triangle cube and then small second small triangle and this rectangle so all of these parts are done and we can can make can take a house that is for these dolls to play and then we've got a red key let's open this cabinet take digit 2 and we have a key and a lock but we can see that this lock is blue and the key is red but we have a blue paint so now red key can open blue lock and then here's a heap of balls and each ball has its pair so the puzzle like that you have already seen in that game now we need to find all the pairs for these balls and only one uh, will remain So the one remained is the ball to give to a, to a frog. Okay, let's give it here and get the plank with the July month written on it. And that way we can just change uh, the table to change uh, winter into the summer then you can take glasses and give them back to Koala so here's surprise that I'm not a bunny but I'm a boy and so with these chokes we can uh, you solve the puzzle on a board so it sounds scary for the teacher is a 
uh, huge and loud. Now let's solve puzzle. Here we are to select four pieces that match this shape. And the pieces are this one, it's for this place, and this bottom part is here. Then this top part is from this place, and this is the top. Letter A is made, and then let's make letter B. This part is here, then this, let's mark this, this one, and here we have to set five parts. And it seems that this part also match here, but we have this, this part is unsolved, but we need to mark them like that. And then this way we don't need uh, this symbol, but we need this. So now that's done. And now let's solve the same puzzle for letter C. Okay, let's try to guess at the first time which numbers to use. Oh, and now we have guessed them correctly, so that's the solution. And the puzzle is complete. Now the teacher is not so scary, Mr. Bear. So we have solved all the puzzles in the class. We've got letters A, B, C. We've got digits from 1 to 3. And now we can open the door and go to the final portal. So farewell to everyone and going uh, to the portal to finally try to wake up. Here it is. Let's go through it. And here's the final puzzle to solve. This puzzle is kind of a memory puzzle. So we have a part of the picture and we need to recover it when we place it on the right position. This bunny goes to this place. This seems to be here. And we can see that there is a border, so we can uh, match the picture according to the border. Here's part of the boy's head. Check this one. It's for this place. This is a boy's and bunny's parts. This is a bunny. And now swap this two. So the picture is done. Now we move through the memories and let's also solve the puzzles like that. So it's part of the plane. It's his family, no, not family. Okay, so this one is on its correct position. Yarn is, seems to be somewhere here. This part is part of the plane. Okay, let's try to get this one. Books. Then this top and left. Bricks. Let's place them somewhere here according to the shadow, kitten and box and plane. Here's the kitten, he's running, plane is flying, plane's wing, plane's propeller, yarn, bricks should be somewhere here I think then this bricks and part of the of the tail this group is flying in the plane 
plane's tail. Cat's tail. And little left to solve. So the picture is completed and the third picture to make. Uh, here's this world. Oh, it is right here on its correct place. This one. This is somewhere from the bottom. Let's try to hit it. This one is part of this door. Then, smiling boy, uh, the bottom rod. Okay, these two are correct. Another part of the door, just confetti. Another part of of this rhombus man. I don't remember how what his name is. Here they are. This somebody in the box and part of the door. This place is, seems to be from here and further. So remaining two tiles to solve that puzzle. So that's the end of the game. Let's walk the final video and if this video walkthrough helped you, don't forget to leave likes, subscribe and bye. But in short I want to say that this game in my opinion was uh, the the cutest game of all the hyper games it's so cute and uh, cozy so early is falling down to fall uh, into the bed and fall out of sleep wake up and be ready to go for his first and great day first day in the school <laughs>